Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel for another video. If you are new to my channel, I appreciate you being here. Um, as you can see, I'm working on a 24 by 24 inch gallery wrap canvas, um, but I did want to go ahead and paint the sides um, just in case I don't get everything covered. Um, this should cover it really well. So I'm using three colors. That is it. Um, I had an accident actually on the corner over here. Um, I was mixing some paints. My paint spilled, and if you have seen any of my videos, <laughs> you know I'm notorious for spilling paint. So, I spilled paint on this canvas, and I went, oh, those colors are beautiful together. Okay, I've got two big cups here, so I'm just going to start pouring my colors. I'm going to pour them for my pie. There we go. Come down a little. Let's see if I can get some cool reaction there. Just wiggling it back and forth. Gives me a little pattern. Okay. And I have a second cup. I'm going to go the opposite direction on this one. But I do think I'm going to Wiggle a little pattern. The higher up you are, the more they mix. The closer you are, the more. There we go. There we go. All right. Pretty, pretty colors. Go ahead and pop my air bubbles. And I'll do that again in a minute. There's a lot of paint. So, let me move my cups out of the way. Knowing me, I will temp one. It'll splatter all over the wall. Cup is beautiful. I don't know if you can see it or not. All right. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of air bubbles. And I'm just going to kind of get the paint all over the canvas. I love these colors together. That purple and that turquoise is so pretty. Look at there. I did not even do it like a ring pour. And it's got rings all in it. Pop my air bubbles again. direction. Like I said, this is a big canvas. 24 by 24. Go ahead and go off that corner and bring it back. And go off this corner. Bring it back. And I'm going to turn it. sides are pretty. Okay. I want it to go this way. Now I have some. I'm going to go ahead and just wet this a little bit. Help it move along. This is just extra paint from my cup. And I have some more paint over here. I'm just trying to use what I've got. Might as well put some of the purple in there. Use what you've got. You're pushing it off anyway. No sense in not using what you have. There we go. Sorry about the tapping sound. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and push that off from the outside. And stop. Some paint there. Don't really have any magenta left. Might have a tiny bit. Go ahead and scrape my cup. Get some magenta in there. There we 
go. It's amazing the effects you can get sometimes with just like three colors. And get some blue in there. Did not mean to drop that. Get some blue in there. I'm gonna push it off so it should be all right anyway. Okay, just use what I had in my cups. And I'll push that off. There we go, there it goes. Just a second more, all right. Colors are so pretty. Bring it this direction. And a little more this way. You just have to tilt it a little bit. Sometimes it just takes it a minute. There it goes. Oh, I think that's super cool. Super cool. I really love the color combination. Wow, for it not being a ring pour, it sure did turn out like one, but I really, really like it. I think it's so pretty. Wait to show you all the lines. There's a few cells, not very many. I really thought I'd get a few more, but I didn't, and that's okay. Um, I'll bring you down for a close-up, and I'll see you in just a minute. Okay, here's the overall painting. Sorry, I'm having to show it to you <laughs> kind of sideways. It is big. My arms just aren't that long. But I love all the different variations of color from three colors. Oxazine purple, turquoise, and magenta. Beautiful rings. I realized in the first cup I had poured the colors down the side. So I went ahead and poured the second cup down the side. So this is what gave me the rings. Even though I just poured it on top of each other instead of going in a circle motion. In the center here, I did take a skewer and I went through the middle just to give it a little bit more definition. And I also added just a hair right here and over here, some purple going into the blue, just so it wouldn't, wouldn't so much blue in one spot. But I got a few cells, not many. But I like the way the outside is darker the center is bright, should dry beautifully. And the sides turned out amazing. Very pretty. Let's see if I can see this side. Here's that side. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. And as always, you have a great day. Bye.